New tonight, a couple whose precious baby passed away is warning parents of newborns. Don't let anyone kiss your child. Their daughter died today after contracting a deadly virus from a kiss. NBC Charlotte's Rachel Brown is live and Rachel, gosh, this is just heartbreaking. Sarah, it sure is. It's tragic. That baby girl fought for her life for more than a week, but this morning died at the hospital. I always thought like this stuff that just happens and it's a shame and never really never thought it would happen to me was was not prepared at all. One week ago, Shane and Nicole Seafried shared their unthinkable story as their newborn baby Mariana fought for her life. Tuesday morning at just 18 days old, Mariana passed away. Her mother sharing this post on Facebook saying, quote, she is no longer suffering and is with the Lord. Doctors in Iowa say Mariana contracted viral meningitis one week after she was born, caused by HSV-1, the herpes oral virus. We noticed that she had stopped eating and wasn't waking up when we were trying to get her to respond. The exact symptoms doctors say a newborn with this illness would experience. Infants typically when they develop meningitis are sleepy, they're not feeding well, and just a change in their, in their general demeanor. How she got it? Likely from a kiss. HSV is spread through oral to oral contact, so not letting people kiss your baby on the mouth. Have them kiss the feet or touch the feet instead um, is a much safer way for people to have contact with newborns. Though doctors say this is an extremely rare case, they warn that cold sores don't have to be present to spread the virus. Saliva can also carry the infection, so parents of newborns especially should be alert. I think it's something to at least be cautious about. And interestingly, both Mariana's parents tested negative for HSV type 1. I'm live in Charlotte tonight. Rachel Brown, NBC Charlotte. That's terrible. All right, Rachel, thanks for that report.